Hey, what's up, Twitch, YouTube? This is your boy, Xbox Frequency, bringing you guys another five-player game. I'm just looking at my map, and I'm seeing what is going on here. Okay. So, I don't really... I don't see what... I didn't see what white and blue did here, so... Can assume white's probably gonna go for <clears throat> This is what I'm gonna do. This is what I'm gonna do here. I'm just gonna get my star out here in Middle East. But yeah, but basically I don't know. I'm just kinda leave one in Africa. Wow, look at this 444 triangle. But uh, I'm just going to go for my star and I just kind of want to Oh, what did I want to do here? Yeah, sorry. I did want to move push them all north right now. I'm giving blue an easy one there, but I just kind of want a strong force there. We can say Red's probably going to take South America pretty early here today. Here. Nice. You can't this turn, though, so that's good. Oh, sorry. He could, because he can bring them back. Sorry. Yeah, he could take it. That's okay. But he's not going to take it. He's just going to secure his borders here. And that's probably a good conservative move on. Red's part there. He could have he, he could have took it though, but but I like the play that Red's doing. Just be a little safe. Bring those down. Oh, I see someone's tuned into the stream. John Paul, if that's you, just give me a quick comment if that's you. I'm assuming that's probably you. <laughs> hey, what's up, man? What's going on? Oh, I think we we lost John Paul there a second. Taking no losses there. To take Australia. I just, I kind of want to just know if Blue's going for North America here. So I kind of move those out because I, I don't know if he wants the gateway to North America and then. That's what he's thinking. So it's swinging on to me here. So basically that's by me moving those away, I gave the gate for blue, because I think, I mean, I want to go for North America, but I just, blue already has five and four, now he has 11 here. Oh, it doesn't make sense for me, so. Yellow's kind of going for Africa. I see how everyone's kind of carved out. Red's going to carve out South America. So I kind of have to carve out Europe here. 
What I'm gonna do actually is I'm gonna come into Russia here. I'm gonna bring them all in the Russia, but I'm gonna leave two behind here. Kind of like that four in India there. You know what? I'm gonna bring. Actually, I'm gonna leave. I know. I'm gonna not give any easy ones though, but I'm gonna bring. Cause I kind of need to work. I need as many troops as I can to kind of work on Europe right now. But I don't want to just give easy ones for. Uh, for White out there, because he's got an early, that's the thing. White's got an early, he's got that five and six, two in Asia. That, it's just not, I was thinking about maybe contesting for Australia, but it didn't make any sense with his five and six. He had a five and six in Asia, so it kind of just makes sense for me to, to hit Europe here. Yellow getting his star out in North America. That's what I mean. It. It's going to be a lot of easy ones here in North America soon, I feel. Blue's going to be able to pick up a lot of that. Oh, yeah, he's going to probably want to get rid of that yellow force there. Oh, I'm going to just crack open a nice cold Stella. Yeah. So white just putting them on the back burner there. Second layers of defense. Indonesia. So swinging on to blue here. He's got four stars. He's got a lot of easy one options here. Assuming he's gonna move them out of Europe. Never mind. I guess he's moving them into Europe. Okay, so I'm just <laughs> what he like. Oh my god! I just great. I I just it's just that move was just so funny. It's like I don't understand why. He doesn't want North America, but okay. I'll take it. Sure. Um, okay. I'm going to get my star here in North America. So what I'm gonna do is this. Uh, yeah, sorry. Um, so either I'm gonna bring them back to Russia and I have a 14 force here now. So what my thinking is, I can either bring that 14 force and go east and go to North America that way. I don't know, maybe blue wants to just come through, so I'm kind of opening the gate. I mean, not really opening the gate out of Europe, but... This is not good. White and red off to a really strong start here. It's not good for the rest of 
of the players here. Blue doing that kind of unorthodox move to just move them all out. I don't know. Maybe he's got some plan here, like... I don't know. player here. Red's nothing, actually. White's a way bigger superpower. That's so funny. I just checked the numbers right now. I thought white and red were about the same. White has like 10 more troops. And three more territories. And five stars at the moment. He's, he's quite the... He's definitely the superpower in the realm right now. Look at that. Pfft. He's got half of Asia already. Jesus. But I got other like fish to fry like blue. Hopefully he's like, I don't know what he's going to do here. I mean, I might have to just go east. I don't know if this is personal vendetta, but I, I really don't know why he'd... Okay, um. okay then. I gotta exodus everything here. I gotta ex exodus everything to North America now. Or I just at least have a major force out in Asia even if I can't get a continent right now. kind of bringing those troops out he's gonna give it to yellow though I think if I was red I would give it to yellow here too because we get Yellow took Africa, yep. Wow. White putting them all in Indonesia there. Swinging on the blue. I'm assuming he's. I'm assuming he's kind of going for Europe here. So my opponent's getting their real estate <clears throat> quite early here.
continue the draft phase. Hmm. See, uh, ch ch I think what I have to do here is because white has so many cards I think he's got a lot of stars here he's only got the thir the 13s on the back burner all he's got is the nine Sorry, my mic disconnected there, guys. Sorry about that. Um, I know yellow white has a lot of stars. I don't think he's going to take me out. But I kind of want to trade in here. Because I don't want to be worth anything. And I just kind of want to get... My force is pretty close to North America here. Actually, I just want to get my forces in Camp Chaka here. I'm just getting everything out of here. I know this is all going to be... Opening up. It's all easy ones now, so blue and white are... I'm just kind of getting out of the way here. I just kind of want to stay back right now. I know people got trade-ins. Here's a big trade-in from Red. I just kind of wanted a major force here. Just sit him. Red's gonna break yellow here. Also gonna say hello to Europe. That's not good though. Oh, this is why this is not good. Is I like the initiative, the break, but White's got like eight stars. I'm pretty sure. That's the only reason I don't like those breaks there. But I mean, it helps me. It didn't hurt me, so. If I take this down seven games in a row, this is a good game, too, so far. White's got eight stars here. Interesting play. So it's swinging on to me.
I just want to put three on Kamchaka. Yeah, end my turn. Yeah, throw it on the Northwest Territories. Bring everything out, of finally. And I'm not really kind of in a rush to get North America here. I mean, I'm going to get a lot of... Like, it might even be best in my best interest to just... Not go for North America and just kind of keep getting my stars out in, in Asia. Wow. Red's being really ballsy because yellow's got a trade in. That's why it was so weird. I, red breaks him and brings him back, but if not, he's got a trade in. You know he's coming in that way. Nice. But this is good, the balance of power. Come on, break him, break him. Break him. Aw, oh, come on. Oh, that's bullcrap. Come on, break him. That's okay, he hurt him a lot. Yellow, yellow shattered in the pieces here, but... Did hurt red a lot, at least. It's not necessarily red I'm worried about, though. It's white. Like, kind of red's my biggest direct threat because he's got that 17 kind of North America kind of jazz going on. But I'm more worried about white right now because he's got 10 stars and he's already the superpower, I'm pretty sure, right now. Yeah. So 41 plus 30, 71 troops. And. Yeah. Do the math. <laughs> he's basically at 71 troops right now. That's that's why I'm worried. Look at this. Doesn't, no one even listens to me. I wouldn't even break red here. If I was blue. I would pre prepare for like the oncoming onslaught. Ay ay ay, man. This is nuts. Alright. Okay. Hmm. I know, um, that's why I should put them all there. I know White's going to be trying to take AJ. He's got 30 troops. He, at least I can kill five of his or something, slow him down a bit there. So that's why I'm putting them all there, because he's got 71 troops virtually coming in. Gonna split up my force here. I'm just really waiting for what White does here because I think he might take Asia, but we'll see. Hopefully, I can slow him down with that six in Kimchaka a bit. It's gonna slow him down a bit. It's gonna barely do anything, but at least it's something. <sighs> Gotta slow down White here. What? So Red just bailed and. Oh my god. I, I, I'm hoping that he moves them all out to yeah, Venezuela. Please move him out of North America. Do not go up north. Come on, he's... I bet you the algorithm's gonna make him end his turn and move. No, never mind. Oh god. I can't believe that, Rip. 
So like, yellow is basically done. Red's now done by ending the turn there. It's good I kind of just kept the forces in like that. What I've been waiting for. 35, baby. Wow. Oh, yes. Yellow has gone. Yeah, red and see see by red and yellow kind of doing that attacking there wasn't good because see how he was just talking like four turns ago how white is gonna be super powerish. Well, this is it, and that's what I mean. Yellow and red fighting each other didn't like now they're just easy ones everywhere. Try to hold Africa here? Is that his game plan? Hmm, I wonder what his play is here. Eliminate yellow for one star. Hold Africa? Yeah. Yeah, he's gonna go to hold it. So blue trading in here. So I'm hoping the blue knows white's a huge threat right now. No, he's not going to break him in Africa? Come on, bro. Oh my god. He was giving the game to freaking red. No way. <sighs> Do I have to come in through red? Like, I, I don't have enough. Man. I don't know, man. That's a huge advantage he just gave to freaking white there. Hold, letting him have Africa. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's see, I got like. Oh man. See, I know everyone's just traded in, so. Man. I can't break white anywhere, I don't. All right, I think I'm just. I, I gotta line up to break uh, white here uh, next turn I think here I'm just gonna get my star and be conservative here but
<sighs> maybe I can bring some force. Maybe I can break them that way. The only reason I didn't... Uh, Red AI's got four stars here. give him 10 bro ah man that sucks so much i think i think i had to just throw everything i had at him but i would sacrifice the game and break like the game probably for me and breaking white here troops. Boy, oh boy. 18 territories, 80 troops. I got about close to half. Blue's got a little bit more than half. Man. This is tough. I don't know if I'm going to do seven games in a row here. This is this this will be a tough game to pull off here. It's on the blue here. Here it goes. Sorry, my controller died there, as it usually does. It's, like, it's so funny how the controller just... I think my bat it is low battery, so if it does kick off... For like 30 seconds, I'm probably just changing the batteries. I know it's pretty low now. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I see someone's just tuned into the stream. Sorry, I'm just thinking this out here. start here get my start here in central uh, I don't know sorry guys I'm just thinking I, I'm just trying to think what the red's got a big trade in here so you know what I just move them, kind of fold them back here. That's going to be my best bet because red could trade in for six here, which he does. That's that's why I was iffy to like make any major moves there. I knew red had a trade in there. The thing is, I could have risked 
a huge risk in taking him out there for six stars. I could have traded in and took Red out for six stars. The, the only thing I was worried about, it might leave me too weak for blue and white, or white is especially superpower. They probably would have been able to eliminate me. Great. I mean... So I'm in quite a pickle here by red moving those all in the North America. <clears throat> I keep getting dealt with hard situations here, so. Um. Well, you know what? I'm just going to move Exodus them all out of North America. Red can have it. Wish I could have got that four out. He'll probably just take it out, though, here. So red kind of hurt and white there a lot, which was nice. Well, hurt me too, but... White player going to take South America as well is the question. Straight on to blue here. Second superpower. See what he's gonna do. Man, white still got a huge superpower on. Nah, white still got a huge superpower on on blue here. trade in here because yeah, 
I just don't want to be worth anything here for to get eliminated. Leave him on Kanchaka. I have to survive here. Um, if I hurt White too much, I'm. Uh, I mean, Red is White is still superpower. Right? If I'm gonna hurt anyone, it's gotta be him. I'm just hurt. I'm just worried that I hurt White too much. Gonna, I'm kind of feeling that out. I'm gonna kind of. I don't really have. Uh, I'm just kind of hanging out in Asia right now. I got a nice 54, though. You know what I mean? Like I can't. I have no start. Like. I'm still in it. It's just I'm. like swing on to me Gonna move it to Siberia. Why well, move into the Siberia? It's connected to three easy ones. So even if people put troops wherever, I'm connected to nice easy ones. So this is a good sign because we're gonna see red hurt white, who is the superpower. We need to see white get hurt badly. So this is a good sign. That's what I mean. Look at these guys. 81 and 93. White has more stars. White has two continents. He's still the superpower. Blue's not too far behind, but he's definitely... He's no white here. turn. Oh, 
Ah, oh, shoot, it's not connected. Oh, nice. That's good, though. He's cleaning up a lot of easy ones, so I can now recycle these easy ones for cards. Hopefully, at least. Hopefully, he gets them out of there. I don't know. Come on, move him out. Give me the easy one. Oh, that's fine. I think I still have my easy one there. That's perfect. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna get my star. That's basically, I'm just surviving out in Asia right now. That's all I can really do right now. Um, Red AI is just kind of being dumb right now. my batteries are low here. I think it might be, maybe that's why it's turning off even more, more and more frequently right now. That must be really low. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'll trade them out. One second, guys. has nine stars. <clears throat> White has ten stars. So just because I have four stars, I'm gonna trade in so I'm worth nothing. You know what I mean? So I don't be no even though it's a weak trade in. Even though it's a weak trade in. I'm just gonna sit up in Siberia, no one's gonna bother me. Make no sense to attack me or try to eliminate me, I'm worth nothing. And that's all I can do right now. It's just um There's this ridiculous kind of cold war situation building up between uh, blue and white and blue, you know what I mean? It's like the 
they're both the superpowers here, right? They have the most influence. White definitely has the most influence with two continents. Also with a strong 109, and he's got the... Oh, yes, he's getting 12. Oh, yeah, he's got South America now, too. I forgot about that. Oh. What? No. No. I didn't even realize that he has three continents right now. Wow, we gotta break him. Are you kidding me? I didn't even notice that. I have a feeling that like there's some sort of unwritten alliance between blue and white right now because I just nothing is making sense what they're doing. Okay. I don't know if blue wants to give the game like. Yeah, honestly, I don't know. Yeah. Blue's gonna give it to white. Then I guess it is what it is. I don't know. Nice. Please hurt white as much as possible. Yes. Thank God, we can't give them friggin' three continents. I was honestly, because it's it's so ridiculous, I was thinking about taking my 65 and breaking them, but then it's like, I might as well just throw the game for myself. Not necessarily, it's just... Oh, it's just got too much momentum. But that's the thing, if I don't do that, then White just wins the game anyways. Because he's got 10 stars or 11 stars or whatever the heck he's got. And three continents. Like, it's just, he's going to win the game. It's just pure, it's just too much momentum. He's got 110 plus 30 and then, I mean, Blue's got 99 plus 30. He's got 13 stars. <laughs> oh my god I might as well just hammer into him like just hammer into him this is crazy Jesus Really wants to stop me from ever coming into Asia, and he very well can. <laughs> I mean, if he's got an unwritten alliance with Blue here, then then it would make sense for him to do that. Nice, yeah. He's just like, hey, if Blue's not gonna attack me, I might as well just take South America here. <laughs> there goes my chances of going into Australia. Like, I was thinking maybe I could take Australia, but now. Oh, yeah, it's 147. so shocked that that was kind of blues moment he could have traded in and really gave some punishment to to white 
way, but... I think white. My bet... My, um... Gamble would be on white to win this game here, for sure. White will probably take South America here again. It's not like anyone's going to contest it, but... I might as well come around with my force and try to contest it at least. Yes. Yeah, that's a just powerful 60 there. I should have just attacked it, but he had so many stars. I'm just like, oh, even if I do take it, he'll just come back and retake it maybe, but maybe not. There, there was a few options I might have been able to do it. Oh. Can't depend on red to not give this game to white anymore. I'm gonna have to break him South America if he's gonna pull this kind of nonsense, three continent on nonsense. Yeah, even though, look, look at that. I mean, blue does have a 30 star trade in, but I'm just gonna sit in Europe. Blue's gotta gotta be aware that like white has three continents. Like he's he's aware of that, right? Yeah, no, John, John Paul, you make up, bring up great points. It's like I'm caught, I'm like caught between a rock and a hard place, you know. What? He didn't break him? Oh, Jesus. I just know these guys have so many stars. That's why I keep trading at like five stars because I just I know it's just ten, but send a boy to do a man's job. I'll break him. Even though I'm like half the troops that you guys have, I will break him. I just find it so funny he went all the way, but Funny thing is, like, it's not in my interest to break blue right now. Like, look how easy I could break blue. Guess what? It's not in my interest whatsoever to. My interest is to take care of the superpower, which is white, and not let someone have three continents. Maybe I just need to take South America and that will kind of create some sort of balance here thing. So I can't keep letting them push for that third continent. It's so ridiculous, man. Yeah, I don't know. If Blue's not going to come in, I'll just come in here. This might not be a bad gig, actually, for me. Go 45 25 kind of thing. Attack 
I just like, I just like, I was like, oh, I might, if I'm broke, I broke them. I didn't even think it would take about South America, but it makes sense to just take it. I'm just like, oh, I'll just break them, but it's like, well, might as well just take it. Finally, t finding a home for the first time in the game. Quite still huge here, though. I mean, if blue trades in, he's got quite a bit of stars, I believe, too. I've... So does white, though. They both have a lot of stars. Which means he got, he's got five. White's still the superpower for sure. It's good though, I... White now able to bring out a lot of that force defending uh, eight Australia. Or he might bring it back, but. What? Check this. Check this next move that I do. See what White just did? How he dedicated everything there? Check this. And he just opened up Australia completely. Blue could trade in and polish up Australia easy here. And he literally took like 35 and brought it over. I, after Blue has his turn, just like watch what I do. You guys will laugh. It's actually amazing that he did that, honestly. Are like these guys 100% allies or something? Like, why is blue boxing me in now? You know what I mean? It's like he's got that 60. Yeah, I didn't know if he was going to leave him there or not. Maybe I overreacted. Maybe he'll block him in a bit. What a jerk, eh? They're definitely 100% a team. Like, look at these guys, little teammates. Probably feel so proud of themselves. Hey guys, we're teammates. What a joke. He'll, what a joke. What a joke. Go ahead. Give, just give the white to game. I don't care. Just give him the game. They're 100% a team. There's no way that they're not a team here. Like, as soon as I moved into South America, like, all his forces went that, like, a vast majority of just went that way. He's like, he's not even worried about Europe. Look at these guys. They got twice the amount of troops as I do. Let's give White the game, Blue. Congrats yourself. Pat yourself on the back. Or I should—they should both pat themselves on the back because they took down the win.
I don't get it. If they are like on a team, I don't know why they're not just not like targeting me. It's really weird. Well, blue obviously cutting me off there was like a clear sign. Be like, there's no need. You know, maybe he wanted a force to get easy ones in Asia or something, but I don't know. So maybe Blue just trying to keep his options open, but now he knows I'm coming. I might have overreacted there, but like it just seemed like they're just... They didn't even break me. <laughs> no. You know what? It honestly just makes so much sense. You know what? I do want I want to come down here first because I want to take my guys out. That's fine. As much as I don't want to give white South America. I mean you just moved like a zillion troops over. I'm just like, yep, blue and white are definitely an ally. I should move mine out because they're coming for me. Right, that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm moving them out. I have an idea, though. I just want him out of here. I mean, it seemed like he didn't really care. White didn't really care about that massive force in Europe. Blue's 40, but as soon as I moved my force there, he just, like, moved, the sh like, 35 extra troops there. You know what I mean? I left a lot there, but you know what? In his defense, I kind of left a lot for a defense, so you might have been scared. But still, though, when I think you guys are on a team, I have to make moves. Like, like look at this. Out, it's been even if it's not an official alliance, it's it's like it's it's more like they're probably like, hey, let's. They're probably like message each other and been like, hey, let's just. Um, not attack each other till it's me and you left or something. Like, I know people who play that. It's like, hey, let's just not attack each other till it's me and you left. Oh, what? Yeah, they're giving me South America now. This is so weird. I really don't know what to do here. I'm just kind of... I might have been good in South America now. I didn't even think of that. But now that's 70 there. It's not even for two troops. I'm going to have to... You know, two troops a turn. I'm going to have to hold off against that 70. The nice thing is he's got the 40 there too, but... Whatever. Let these guys tangle for it. Or blue, North America was all yours. Ten bonus troops, go for it. <clears throat> Just staying alive, that's all I can do. They got double my, my troops. I really, my... It's almost like that, that saying, uh... 
run a battle, run away to uh, fight another day. You know what I mean? That's kind of what I'm doing. I'm kind of on the back burner here. I kind of got to hold back a bit here, you know? Man, white is huge. Look at the white and blue. They're both massive now. I know white has more stars, though. I know white still ha is the superpower. He has been the whole time. Just because he has more stars. They have about the same amount of troops. Ish, but... Oh, actually, blue's got seven. Blue's close, but he's not quite the superpower here. He's close, though. He's getting nine. Look at blue go. You can't be serious in holding though, South America here. Really interesting play on Blue's part here. I gotta trade in here. I can't be worth anything to these guys. They just have too much. Like, blue has, like, a crap ton of stars. So does white. It's just, like, as soon as I have, like, five stars, I'm, like, worth something. You know, to kind of take out. Not really, but... I just want to give my opponents no reason whatsoever to target me. Just kind of surviving out in Asia. Had a little South America. You know what? I think I might have been able to stay in South America. But at this point, I don't think it's worth it for just the two bonus troops, honestly. Big trade in 38. Oh, man. Wow. Is he going to do it? Is he going to finally be able to hold South America here? Yeah, he will. We ain't going to do nothing. Jesus, 202. Jesus. I mean, blue trades in and he has like one. Yeah, this game is really insane. It's like this insane Cold War going on between like blue and white, but they're kind of like allies, maybe unspokenly. I don't know. So weird, it's like the same thing it's been. Funny thing is if I like took Australia here or something, 
Let's say I took Australia, or I did like last time and I had 60. I bet you blue and white would not even, like, white would probably direct all his forces over to me, and then blue would still probably, like, let him hold Africa. Let's just say. There you go. Frick, you might as well, man. I'll give him North America for a turn. White's still the superpower, so this will make kind of blue probably surpass him in superpowerness. <sighs> this is a tough game. I really want this seventh win, but honestly, these guys are so huge at this point. Yeah, like double my troops. Nothing I can really do at this point. America here. And that might just be the advantage that Blue needs to um, grind out uh, White in the long run here. Let's get in my turn, get my star, grind out in Asia. So this is crazy right now. Oh man, I'm gonna be so happy when I have a computer like this mic issue going off constantly. It's driving me nuts. I'm t I'll start talking and then I'll be like, oh, my mic's off. Oh, great. Let me just restart that whole thing. That well, my whole train of thought. Man, this I'm I'm really kind of shocked that white would let blue have you know what I mean? Have North America as well. I thought that would be like the breaking point for him to like hurt him. But no. with 10 stars here too. White, I know White has a lot, but Blue trades in. He's got, Blue trades in, he's a new superpower. And he's got North America.
Okay, so we don't have to wait here. So hilarious. No, I, I think White's re got the momentum here on Blue. No. White clearly is doing the right move here, and that's eliminating Red. Red just got a double star, too. He just had four stars there. And then he literally just got like a double star, and it went to like White's turn, so. So yeah, no, white is a superpower for sure. Uh, still here. It's just because you can eliminate these cards, even if blue does trade in. They'll be still close, but still, now white's got that momentum. Look how many territories he has, too. 23 strong territories. Ay, 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 ho. Hey, oh, hey. Weird as this sounds, it's like I want to give Blue North America. I, I could break him, but White's still kind of like the superpower here. Like, this is a tough game. If I get myself out of, if I pull a W out of my arse here, basically, that'd be amazing. I don't know how that's going to happen because. the superpower at the moment but he just he just traded so like I said as soon as I get five stars I trade in for ten so I don't want to be worth anything I've I'm in the triple digit zone here but staying alive that's all I got right now <sighs> white getting 12 nine stars thing is like I could hit I could use my 107 force and take Australia there's been many a times where I could have probably took Australia this game to literally like waste that many troops and white has been having a lot of stars in his pocket this whole game so a lot of times where I could even I could break him but he's gonna trade him for 30 and basically I'm done at that point and then I just give a huge vantage point to blue it blue is getting the most troops though right now 15 versus whites 12 but the thing is white has got more stars so 
white is would be still the superpower in my opinion. And oh, he's still in South America. Yeah, I'm half sorry. I'm always half paying attention. He took South America. So I mean, he's probably gonna give it to him, man. I guarantee he's not even gonna break him that 50 to 11. Man, if he doesn't break that 50 to 11, like there's clearly a team going on here. Like I don't care what anyone says. Like if you guys are dead, even superpowers, and you can break him easy. You don't. No, he won't. You guarantee he's not gonna break up South America. Are you kidding me? He ain't doing that. He's gonna start out in Asia here. <laughs> it's like, nah. I think blue is. I think blue is probably gonna lose. I think white is gonna win this game for sure. That's who I'd put all my money on here. Like, that's crazy to me. I don't know. I don't know why that's so insane to me, but that 50 on 11 to, like... I would 100% have done that on this turn if I was him. Why should I expect anything less, you know? Like, honestly. I'm just getting bored, because, like, I know this is so boring, but this is, like, on if, like, I'm, I'm playing to really win here. Like, this is what I would do if I wanted to play to win. But the problem is, is two superpowers are not attacking each other. They're just like, hey, let's build up till we get a zillion troops. We won't attack any borders, even if they're weak. And, uh, yeah, we'll play a fun game. Happy fun game. Nice. See, if I was white here, I'd trade them in and put all on that South American border. Doesn't matter, you can put him all in a, inactive there in Indonesia, because he's probably worried about me. Doesn't matter, if I hit him there in Australia, what, am I going to get two? I'm going to waste 106 to get two? It's insane. See, I would... Oh, Blue's got to punish him for that, for not putting him on that 11. I would punish him heavily for that. Put him all inactive in, in Indonesia. Oh, Blue, please just punish him for that. Like, that's just... Come on. This game... I'd put 16 there and punish him heavily in South America. Heavy punish. Sorry. Oh, they're just... I feel like we're going to be here until, like... We're going to be here for the next few mill uh, millenniums here, let's just be honest. I just really wanted to win seven games here. I'm not giving up, though. I'm not giving up. They have huge momentum on me. They really do. They're getting so much way more than me. They really are. <clears throat> At the same time... 
I am living. I have easy ones. I am surviving. I mean, obviously, my 106 is the direct threat, not Blue's 50. You know what I mean? It's like, what? But if you're watching this, like, John Paul, as you watch this, like, it's just... <laughs> like, 50 and 11. It's just like, that's so laughable. It's like, no. It's just like, White's putting them all there. I'm not even going down there. But it's like, he knows he doesn't have to worry about Blue coming in South America, so he puts them all in Australia. It's just like, it's so weird, like, you know what I mean? It's just like, pff, mind blown. Just look at that, 50 and 11. Like, that is nuts. Oh, he'll give it to him in the next thousand turns, guaranteed. Blue will have 10,000 there, and White will still have 11, and they won't break it. It doesn't matter. The numbers don't matter. They're nothing. They're they're already like it's pure alliance. Wait, what are these are guys' actual names here? Just so if I remember I'm playing with them. Just because I won't play with them next time. If I see their name pop up in the like the lobby, you know what I mean? I'll just leave the room. Make a mental note. I really want this game though. I'm not giving up. If I gotta stay here for five hours, I will. If we're gonna spend a millennial of this going on, I'll do it. I'll go on stream for 10 years straight watching this game. I'll do it, man. I'll do it. I'll do 10 years straight. I want that seventh win. Gotta trade in. I don't want to be worth anything. These guys are obviously clearly targeting me. So if I have zero stars and they like just go to eliminate my 116 force, I'll know for sure they're on a team. It's already pretty obvious, but like I'll just know for sure, for sure. Obviously, I'm the biggest threat, right? Not Blue's 50 on your 11. You know, he ain't doing nothing there. <laughs> Sorry, I just... I don't mean to make it an ongoing joke. It's just like it's... It's just like humorous to me. Oh, really? Are you really worried that much about Blue there? Is that why you're moving him there? Don't worry, he's not coming in. Put him on Southeast Asia. I'm the worry. I'm the one to be worried about. That's good. He should be putting it. Honestly, why well, he should be putting him on Southeast Asia? I am the one he should be worried about. I'll do this for 10 years if I have to, until this Cold War has ended. Or I should say, until this, once this Cold War begins, I'll, I'm going to be doing the same thing I've been doing, staying alive in Asia for a thousand years, if I have to. I 
on seven games in a row. There's no way I'm not. Even if they have an alliance, I'm still gonna fight them till the end. You know what I mean? Even if they're never gonna attack each other, I'm even. I'm just gonna keep bulking up. I'm just gonna keep trying to survive. I'm gonna win this game. I just, I'll just know. Like if he blindly attacks my 117 here, I'll just know that it's a pure alliance. You know. Maybe he's trying to get territories here. I don't know what he's thinking. This is actually something changed. Usually just he goes for a star, ends his turn. So this is a little something different. Probably just wanted a few more territories in his. Maybe it's a smart move on his part. He wants a few more territory so he can have that slight edge on white or whatever. Oh, excuse me. For Siberia, my star. My turn, fortify phase. Wait, he finally gets it. Wow, he finally grows a pair and breaks it. Jeez. That's crazy. That's the most ambition I've seen from Blue all game. See, I thought I would have just broke him. I, I can't believe he put his 49 up there to White's 95. I give him that's ambitious. I was I would just say break him, but. Gosh, excuse me. Sorry about that. I'm gonna bring him down to Mongolia. More options this way. And my turn. Yep, I'm obviously the biggest threat. Yes, Southeast Asia. Inactive. Yep, I'm the biggest threat. <laughs> oh, there we go. That's that's why, I, in my opinion, I would have just broke something. I didn't want to. I wanted to put my up on there. Yeah, I think it was a little too ambitious of Blue to try to hold South America. I just was saying break him just because he could, right? He could sit him, 
And then White would have to move his troops, you know, if he didn't take White's territory there. If he didn't, Blue didn't take White's territory there in Brazil, then he wouldn't have anything to worry about. Ah, he's gonna break him. North America, too. Ah, he's gonna break him everywhere! <laughs> he could just easily break him Europe, but he doesn't. What? Oh, what? Okay. That would be so hilarious. It's like now... So by him not breaking Europe, he's going to now use those five troops against that force there. That'd be hilarious if that happened right now. So, yeah, we still got that five from Europe. That's for sure. It'd be just so funny if you put them all on 80 and then use those five. Oh, he's going to trade in here. And honestly, like... Pfft. They both got 250 troops. The thing is, White has 100 of those troops in, in Australia inactive. 109 troops in Australia inactive. If I was blue, I would expose the heck out of White. I mean, I think it's they both have 250, 250. <laughs> Blue could easily break him everywhere, smash Red's Africa forces. He's got them all inactive, 100 f troops inactive. So Blue basically has 100 more troops in the battlefield now. Then he has 100 more troops than Red, White, you know what I mean? They're all in Australia. Look at them all. Just sitting there. Can't do nothing. They're sipping tea, doing nothing. They're out of the battle. They're not, they're not contesting blue. You know what I mean? They're literally just doing nothing. Yeah, take it for sure. I, if I was blue, I would 100% take this. Yeah, what's he gonna, like, let's see, if he breaks you again, then you come down with your 80. Doesn't he have to attack him here? I would have just stopped. Might as well. He could he could probably take four continents. Yeah, and if he think about it, if Blue takes Europe, Africa, South America, and North America in this turn. What's White gonna do? He's got a hundred and nine friggin' troops sitting in Indonesia sipping tea. They ain't doing nothing. He's gonna have to t waste the whole turn to bring them out. You know what I mean? It's funny that Blue actually ended up being the aggressor here. It was like whoever was kind of the first aggressor there was going to kind of take this game. And also by White thinking I was such a huge threat for Australia, leaving. Like that's why the whole game I'm joking. Oh, yep, put them all in Southeast Asia, inactive. I'm not, I'm like, I'm the biggest threat. When like I had, I had a little bit of interest in going into Australia, but it just never seemed worth it to me. You know what I mean? For two, I'm just like, ah, I gotta waste a zillion troops to maybe hold for two. No, it's like, ah. Uh, no. Honestly, no. He it, This is a good move on blue. Yes, like he said, he has 100 more troops than white on the battlefield. And that's why he's polishing him up. That's why he's wiping the floor with him right now in Africa. He's, he's barely up anything there.
No, this is actually a great move on on uh, Blue's part. I would have stopped maybe at South America, but then I'm thinking, I'm like, he's got 109 troops in sitting isolated in Australia. I'm like, yeah, for sure. <laughs> like, take him out, you know what I mean? Oh, God. Great move. That's an amazing, beautiful play by Blue. Honestly, just beautiful. He's basically forced me to, like, break him. Right? Like, we have to break Blue here. Basically, before I could make a real move, I had to wait for that Cold War to end there. I'm surprised Blue came on top of that Cold War, to be honest. I'm very shocked. Obviously, I can't let him have... Oh my god, I'm losing, like, a lot. More than I should be. God, come on. What I'm gonna do here. So I'm gonna break, basically, I'm breaking blue everywhere and I'm taking South America in the process. No, basically, I need to. We needed to break blue there everywhere. Uh, I suffered a lot of losses here, but now I'm kind of. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna move these five out. I'm actually gonna give blue uh, North America and stuff out. I'm gonna keep a few out in Asia here. I just, I had to break them everywhere because I, I just could not depend on um, white breaking them everywhere. I see someone's just tuned in the stream. Nice of you to join in. A lot just happened. I was out in Asia for the, a lot of the game, and now I've moved to South America. Blue had four continents. I broke them everywhere. Just in the insurance. Like, 
I wish White would have done it, but I didn't know because I went before him, so I had to do it kind of before here. No, this is a good game, actually. They just, like, blue and white had, like, 250 troops, and I probably had, like, 125. They literally had double my troops, but now it's kind of back to... They had a little huge Cold War. They were building up all game, and then they finally attacked each other. And then blue took four continents. Then with my 1010 force, 25 force, I took... Broke them everywhere, and then took... Uh, on to me. <clears throat> so I'll bump it up to 35 here. That's just force. Oh, why did I, oh. Oh, I'm, I don't, oh. Why did I do that? Oh my god, I could have broken you. I'm what is wrong with me? In my mind he didn't have Europe. Oh whatever. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm so stupid. Oh well. It you know what? As ridiculous as that sounds, it's quite alright. White has like ten a bunch of stars, so. so stupid. White could hurt him, which would be in his good in interest to break him Europe here too, and he could hurt him bad. I'm so dumb. Listen, we can't give him two continents. I see someone else is just in the stream. Nice of you to join in. JJ Genesis, how's it going, man? Nice of you to join the stream. So this is a, a good thing, a really good thing. Nice, it's gonna break them all around. Nice. No, that's so huge. That's so huge, that really stopped the momentum here. Nice, that's, that's big news. This is big news. Man, I swear 10 turns ago, it looked like I was hopeless, you know what I mean? It literally looked like, I was like, oh, this is hopeless. You know what I mean? But no, not quite. I mean, you just line that 29 up to, like, take me out. You know what I mean? Like, see how he's just, like, he's got nowhere else to go? It's like, you'd think he would put it up, like, in here so he could take white or... Like, white is still the superpower here. Just looks like he wants to turn his attentions to me or something. I don't know. It's really weird. Choose my lucky 
It's a lucky number, so why not? <clears throat> oh, whatever. I'll just move into Russia if he's going to put his troops that way. Oh, no. Sorry. I'm connected to them. No, but that's good. By me freeing... Sorry. What I meant to say is by me freeing up Russia here. He can use that 29 force to go get out that way now, too. You know. We should just refocus on, like, resecuring Europe or, or North America here. He's got that 35 force that's going to keep me at a standstill, like... How many troops? How many territories? Blue does have more territories than than white here. You know, like I said, he can refocus on his Europe here. He really could, it, you know what I mean? He probably could. If he moved that 35 out of North America. Decides to do something pure chaotic, chaos, and uh, he just gave the game to White. Basically, it's funny in one move how you can almost give the game to like someone else. Nice. What did you do? Break me? Oh no, you got Africa though. Great job. Nice. Awesome on not targeting the. Uh... That's a great idea, Blue. Let's not target the superpower. Great idea, buddy. Yeah, you're right. Let's just annihilate each other and then give the like the game. Yeah, bring those six Dan down to the thirty-five. Let me box in my opponent who's not a superpower. I'm a great risk player. It's like, come on, bro. If he puts us down on the thirty-five, I'm just gonna friggin' laugh. Like probably will, guaranteed. Yeah. Go for it, man. You're a genius, bro. You're a friggin' yo, you're a genius, bro. Great move, man. Give the game to blue, uh, give the game to white. Great play, buddy. You are a friggin' genius, bud. Yo, did you go to Harvard? Are you sure you didn't? I'm pretty sure you did. Jeez, man. It's fine. I'll take Europe. Fucking genius boy over here. I'm just going to move out here. Like, obviously, Blue's just kamikaze me, so I'm going to fold my troops back here. He's probably going to give the game the white. It's like, I wish I just could play with some actually decent players who knew what they were doing. Like, is that too much to ask? I swear to God, I never get that. I don't even mind taking an honest double, like, an honest L if, like, they just, like, were a great player. I really don't. But, like, just this unorthodox, like, chaos, kamikaze chaosness. It's just, 
not happening, man. I guarantee, watch, he'll trade in, hit me for no reason. Why didn't he just do this four turns ago? Like, I don't understand why he does not just take North America. Like, but he decides to do it five turns later and then puts them all down there. Like, it's like, poof, mind blown. Poof, mind blown. All in all, it's still a pretty good game, I guess. Take your up here. Taking a big chance here. I'm assuming that white's gonna break blue in North America. It's just an easy one. Like I'm just that's why I'm assuming that he he's going to, which he does. <sighs> white's got this like See how, like, blue is just targeting me? It's like, white has, like, double our troops. It's like... And, all, and, and he's lining up every single troop he has onto my border. Sorry, my mic went out there again. Like, broke them everywhere. It's just like... See how I had to move out to Europe? Because I had to. He would have wasted those troops. He probably would have rage quit onto my troops and then gave the game to white. It's like I had to just like fiddle something out. Look, he's not even gonna retake, <laughs> like, oh my God. Maybe, yeah, sorry, I'm freaking out too much. Yeah, see, he's not gonna. I'm not gonna wait. He's probably just gonna break me here because, like, he's a genius. Wait, he's got double the troops, but obviously breaking me makes more sense here. Yeah, of course it does, right? Give the game the white, right, Blue? Why not? Why not? Why not deny me my Xbox Frequency 7 game win streak? Why not deny me that, right? Is that what you're thinking? Why not deny me? Why not be an idiot, right? Great move, genius. Well, are you a genius, man? Wow. 
Just a personal vendetta if I've ever seen one. This is hor this is horrible. This young Ghost 420 is a disgrace to the game, man, honestly. Yep, nice. Yeah, let's just see. It doesn't matter, even if I move, he's still kamikaze, you know what I mean? Even if I try to move out of his way, regardless, he's gonna just give the game to white here. You know, it's like nothing I can do about that. What a genius, man. Blue, you are one big genius. You know what I mean? Look at that. What a game this was. And then it's just like, yep, I'm just gonna rage quit on uh, Xbox Frequency. Deny him that seven games in a row. Why not? Why not? Ah, oh, it pains me, man. It pains me because it was such a good game. I could have won. And then he just rage quits me. It's like, thanks, bro. Nice. Wow, nice, nice play, man. Nice move, man. Nice moves, bro. Nice move, bro. Nice, bro. Yeah. Nice, bro. Nice, bro. Yo, did you get that, like, out of a textbook or something, man? That was genius, bro. I'm done. I'm not going to be able to hold it anyway. Doesn't matter. Blue's going to rage quit on me again anyways. It doesn't even matter. What a game, eh? What a great game. And then it's just like... It's so funny. It's just like I'm running away from him because I know he's going <laughs> to... Just like... Ah, man. It's such a good game, bro. Blue, I hope you denied a streamer of a seven game win streak right there, buddy. Thank you, by the way. Yeah, no, nah, GG. Well, not really. I'd say it was a really crappy game, but GG, congratulations on White for uh, basically winning this game. Man. Like, people, like, it's just, you know, I see that all the time, too. It happens a lot, unfortunately, where someone will just, like, waste everything they got onto someone for, like, no apparent reason. Just, just like, hey, I'm just going to waste everything into you to give the other person the game. Let's not have a good game whatsoever. It's like, all right, cool. <laughs> oh, God. Man, I'm so bad. I just, not like this, you know? If I lost game seven to like a really good loss, like, I would have been okay with it, but just not like this, you know? <sighs> not like this. I'm surprised, um,. I'm actually really shocked that Blue didn't waste all his troops in Greenland to try to, like, hurt me more. I'm actually shocked he didn't do that. You would think he would do that from his last uh, turn, you know, and you think he would just keep wasting them on me. So I'm just really confused why I didn't put him on Greenland and try to hurt my three. I'm, I'm, I'm just confused. Doesn't make sense. It's like, I'm gonna waste every last resource on you. Yep, bye. Thanks, man. Thanks, Blue. Now Blue finally rage quits. He's like, wait, I think I lost this game. <laughs> How am I even alive still? Like, honestly. Joke. How am I alive? 
Ah, this can end the game. I'm just, I'm just so peed off, like, that blue would do that. Like, we had a game. I could have came back and won this game. But blue just... Wow. Kamikaze Dream Shatterer. That's, that's the only way I can explain it. It's basically what blue did to me. Goes game seven down the drain. Man. Just pains me heavily, it really does. <sighs> really could have had this one, man. I really could have made it seven games in a row. Wow, what a game. I was it was such a good game too. Like I had to just stay out in Asia for so long there until they finally connected and then blue had the better, you know, had four continents obviously I'm gonna have to break them. So I do a nice little move, break them all four continents, take South America. And then um, maybe that's why he had a personal vendetta because I broke them. But the game would have been over anyways if I didn't if I didn't break them in four continents, you know what I mean? Or I'd let them have four continents for a turn or two. I think that's what bothered him there was just like that. Oh, I'm still alive. No, I just I like I like to I'm just sticking around. I know I've lost, but I like to stick around until like the board is finished usually. Even though I'm not like I'm obviously done. Nothing I can do at this point. I guess I could have broke him everywhere for the heck of it, but it doesn't matter. He's got eight stars. At this point, I'm I'm basically forfeiting because there's nothing I can do. I don't know why that word came to my mind. I'm like, he's basically just a kamikaze dream shatter. Like I really wanted to win seven in a row. <laughs> ah, the kamikaze dream shatter. Oh, blue. It's like he was playing so non-aggressive the whole game, and, and then all of a sudden... Like, it just didn't make sense. When I broke him everywhere, I think he just... He didn't realize that, like, yeah, white was get, becoming a slight superpower again. I don't think blue realized that and just kind of, like, raged on me here. Ah, uh, that's the way she goes sometimes, right? Oh, I can't even be taken out this turn. Oh my god. It's like I have a trade-in for 200. That's so fine. That's all good. Yeah, all in all, even though it was a, a bad game, GG Red, you won, buddy. Makazi Dream Shatter for Game 7. Oh, it's just I had the chance, you know? 
it's just having the chance and then just being here for like an hour and a half and then surviving in Asia and then just to lose it all to that. Sorry, I meant to say the game went to white here, so good g GG to white, all in all. Um, oh, that didn't I put my money on white to win, too? That's hilarious. So, unfortunately, taking second place. Um... Yeah, sometimes you can't do it. I just really wanted to do seven in a row. Uh, probably going to put this up on YouTube, though, still. It was a good game, and it was surviving in Asia, and it could have turned into a really good game. But, uh, unfortunately, um, I ended up taking the loss there. Too bad I blew. Just did that kamikaze. Yeah, no, basically blue, just doing that kamikaze, um, dream kamikaze dream shatter. I don't know why I'm going to call it that. It's just such a weird name, kamikaze dream shatter. So it's like, that's what I just felt like happened to me. I was just like, I literally just got kamikaze dream shattered. Like the game was within our grasp. It was still a good three player game. It was all back to even ish amount of troops. White was a slight superpower, but if me and blue kind of. That's too bad. I guess I'm just reflecting on the game. But anyways, guys, thanks for tuning in this stream. Uh, John Paul, as, you, as always, man, thanks for uh, thanks for tuning in. And uh, everyone else who tuned into the stream, that was great. It was awesome. On YouTube, please comment, like, and subscribe. And uh, make sure to check, uh, check me out for more Risk and more content. Lots of stuff's coming out. So thanks always, guys. And I'll talk Xbox Frequency out. Peace out, guys. Have a good one. Keep it real.